evil genius general battle gardener cross knights here. I also dabble in fire magic. This is the final episode of uh, Saga Frontier. <laughs> Kingdom Rush Frontiers. Um, I'm a little bit worried because a bunch of people who commented were just like, it's just the fish people left. Wonder what he's going to do with fish people. Oh boy, hardest level in the game fish people so you know i had enough trouble with the uh, someone said it was pronounced like sassy <laughs> which yeah that could work that guy was a jerk um but as you can see i punked him punked him just needed to properly i don't i don't even know what i did differently that time i defeated him rather easily though still i think i'm gonna go with uh the voodoo queen of New Orleans, and we're gonna go to Port uh, Tor Turgut. Now I don't know if this is a multi-stage or not. Is there? This might very well be two, be two. And if it is, um, I guess it'll be a longer episode where I cut a bunch of things out. So because there is an island here, I mean, there's no, there's no stage at Fool's Bay, but there could be. We'll see. Um, but now we're at Port Tukagagafra. In the past few weeks, sailors and fishermen have raised the alarm in regards to eerie disappearances. Ships and people have been reported missing, vanishing mysteriously in nearby waters. We are still unsure of who or what is behind the disappearances, and our king is asking you to lead a small rapid response fleet to get to the bottom of this new minute. I'm gonna guess it's fish people, according to what people told me, and I, I don't know, I've never even seen what this stage looks like, except in that little preview window. Hey there! Mmm. Take your helmet off, weirdo. It's gonna get super hot. Another fine morning at the beach, huh? Like yesterday and the day before. Anything to report? <laughs> nope. We were lucky to be assigned guard duty on an island. I paraphrased, apparently. Alright, time for those people to be very sad and probably dead. What is this? Payment is fair. Ooh! Um, train one parrot to deliver bombs. I'm liking this. Improves uh, tower's attack speed. Uh, this tower is right in the middle of everything. I'll improve the crap out of your tower's attack speed. I'm gonna wait on the parrots though. We're gonna want a blocker right here. What better place to block than right at a bridge? And then we'll have uh, that'll hopefully reach across the bridge. Put a nice bomb right here. Another arrow. Uh, blocky boys. Down as far as possible. Let's see what happens. I have no idea what to expect. Uh, Desert Thug and Dune Raiders, though. Together again. Oh, you guys, you guys are wolfmen. All right, and level that up. Okay, I see the uh, pirate guy shooting. A lot of guys here, good God. Level up my blockers. And let's bring the fire. All right, level up. I think I want magic here. Probably make that a necromancer thing to get up more defenses. Oh, she just booted the crap out of them. And what do we got? Immortals, desert thugs. All right, release them early. And I really would like these guys to be more leveled up. There we are. Oh no! All right, something weird's happening already. A gunboat. I don't think they're gonna be on my side. Can I put these guys here? Oh god. So I actually have another pirate thing up there that can shoot the gunboat, so that's cool. Um, I could probably also hit it with magic. Let's also make an arrow tower as soon as I can there, and then that'll also hit, because th that's a new mechanic that I didn't know about. Freedom! Uh, there we go. I definitely have enough now. So we'll make you a regular uh, arrow tower. Move the camera out since it likes to zoom in on the emulator for some damn reason. And it looks like Doge's. Yeah, Doge's almost got through. Finally. <laughs> Alright, do that. We got assassins. And what's happening here? Oh, that's new. 
Look, fish people. Vicious fish-like hunters that stalk the shores for human prey can throw nets fast speed. I'm gonna level that up when I can. All right. Let's get some sashimi up in here. Yeah, they give like 20 when I kill them. That's not, I'm gonna drop this. This should give me like 100 gold. Enough to upgrade that once. And my quest to, you know what? I was gonna get an earthquake tower right there. But now that I know about that gunboat, I think I'm gonna turn it into the other type of uh, bomb thing because then it'll probably be able to reach. Desert archers, eep, 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 eep. I don't like that. Uh, all right, we have enough to block these guys. Releasing archers. Maybe I should have waited for my fire spell to level up, actually, because these archers are always rough, but let's shoot them a bunch. Um, eep. All right, we need defenses here. Uh, I didn't prepare from a behind attack. I probably should have. No, I kind of did prepare because of this, though, and they're not. All right, I figured they'd go here, but it looks like they're going on the bridge. Okay. Oh my god, there's a there's a path right down there. Oh damn it, he got past me. Alright, so I didn't know that this was also an exit. I didn't look at the um I didn't look at the uh, the flags down there, so we gotta have blockers down there. And let's pump this up. And let's just drop some fire on the wooden bridge. We should probably just take that bridge out in general. We'll build it when there's not so many fish people around. Sounds like there's usually never danger here, so we'll probably have several months. It'll be fine. Of course, now that I think about it, that'll just screw over my men, because the fish people don't need a bridge. I retract my original plan. Please don't be angry at me, King. I'm just spitballing here. Uh, let's do that. Lots of doges. That gunboat's being a jerk. Get in range. Damn it, it's not in range. Ugh, I hate him. Ooh, we might be able to take him out before his third volley. Sunken. Uh, I'm waiting for... I'm, I'm trying to find out the right moment to drop my fire spell. It's not quite yet, though. Yeah. Kill that. Good. Alright, I think this is the moment. Yeah, that was the moment. <laughs> it's all about timing, yeah? Alright, more guys are going to come down from there. So this is the area that I should be protecting. Over there, you know, at the beginning, but like everything has to come through here. Though eventually... No, I don't think anyone's ever going to come down here, but maybe. You see these, like, speckled stones where my cursor is? That looks like that's a place where people might just start walking. I, I wouldn't be surprised, at the very least. I'll just put those guys there. If one of the fish guys got through, and I have... Oh, wait, that's right, I made blockers. I already prepared for that. Beautiful. Oh, there's a lot of guys there, though. Level you up. Move down. I don't think my guys are going to be able to kill them. Cool. Your skulls and souls are mine! More archers coming. Me no like. See if I can cluster them up a little bit. You are clustered. You are bustered. <laughs> Alright. They're dead. Oh, God. Uh, oh, I'm hitting, I'm hitting that gunship. He is not, oh, he might get his third volley off because it's distracted by fish. There. No third volley for you. Ha. Um, level you up. And make some Templars. They'll be good blockers. Archers coming in. I would love this to be a, um, Necromancer tower. I'd lerve it, lerve it, lerve it. Maybe I should concentrate on this instead. Yeah, I'm close. If we could get some missiles to take care of those gunships. That'd be beautiful. Guys are coming this way now. Uh-oh. Red Spine. 
The Chosen of the Leviathan. These elite warriors lead lesser Greenfin into battle. Ranged attack, heavy armor, average speed. Well, we'll see how powerful you are. You're pretty powerful. Alright, dropping the bombs. Let's dry these fish up. Alright, they're having a lot of trouble. <laughs> they're being blocked right on my uh, mech. Which is great. So when the gunship comes up, I'll just move this guy... Yeah, I figured he couldn't move into the water, but I bet he, he can move right there at least. Then maybe we won't have an issue. Now what's up here? Uh, green? Okay. Just green and red. And how about we put these guys directly on the bridge? Yeah. You guys aren't going anywhere. Immortals and Desert Archers. I'm releasing them early. For I am confident. Perhaps incorrectly confident, but confident nonetheless. And there, I knew it. I saw them cobblestones. All right, so now we need things here. Now these guys, all right, they don't have any armor. I should have checked that earlier. But good to know, no armor. And we need blockers here. And we need fire from above. That should be enough. I'm not even moving my hero. Okay. And we'll put, I guess we'll put another one of these here. Bunch of archers coming in. Very dangerous. Uh, I see a little parakeet. Occasionally, I, I zoom in, but I well, I could always zoom in and post. But there's stuff going on over the map. I don't like to zoom in when there's multiple things happening. Level you up, level you up, level you up in the morning. Also, everyone should watch Russian Doll. Great show. <laughs> but it got an old timey song stuck in my head, and it'll get it stuck in your head too. And it's not a bad thing. Hey there, gunship. <laughs> not a, not this time. <laughs> not today, gun issue. Once I get 300, I'll get my first missile barrage upgrade. Done. 250 to the next one. We're going to try to make that happen quickly. I think this time this one will be an earthquake tower because it should take care of like people going this way and that way. I like that. And, ooh, you're new. Um, boat swine. These sea dogs can really stand their ground while delivering major ownage on the battlefield. Let's find out. 600? Alright. Eh. Pretty good. Oh, he just took so much damage from one spear, though. I think he's just gonna get speared, just like my hero did. But we'll see. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's been a breach. Yep, a lot of guys are getting through. Come on. We can still save this. There we go. All right, so we're not nearly defended enough there if that happened. Uh, but we will be with my necromantic tower. Uh-oh. Or will we? Um, Black Surge. These armored abyssal devils wield ancient magics from the ocean depths. We're fighting the deep ones. Heavy armor can disable towers invulnerable inside its shell. Oh my, they ain't screwing around no more. Man, let's move my hero back. I'm waiting for those guys to come. I don't see them though. Uh, this thing I would like to increase its range. And eventually, it'll hopefully hit the gunboat. All right, there he is. He just disabled that tower. Ha, ha, ha. Useless. High damage, though. Or high high armor. That sucks. That means I need to use magic against him, and I don't have magic in that area. Uh, and that's probably never going to reach up there. I want to drop fire on him, but I'm also just waiting for him to go into a shell like a jerk at the wrong time. All right, we're going to try it, though. All right, he didn't do it. He did it, like, at, right at the beginning, but he didn't do it at the right time, so good. Um, you know what? I'm not going to use a Necromancer there. Because, like, archers keep on coming, they'll just die. We'll just use Increased Magical Fury. All right, there's guys coming out of there and on both seaports. 
Eep, eep, eep. Maximum yeah, counter for you. Bring it. Uh, oh yeah, those are reds. I was like, how come they're not taking... <laughs> they're taking, like, no damage, but they are taking damage. He just has a lot of health. He's almost dead, yeah. Almost dead in the water. Archers are a-coming. Gonna lean in. Uh, I don't like that. I think uh, they can probably take care of that. We're gonna do this instead. Move you guys. Uh, you be, you'll be Templars. Move up. And get your bleed on. Oh, the long range I forgot. Alright, well, surround them. And we got a whole bunch of these, uh, the, the abyssal weirdos. Ah, she has a magic attack, I forgot. They, they, her, their armor won't work on her attacks, so. Not all is lost. <laughs> and, oh, I wanted to upgrade my, uh, wanted to upgrade, but they just disabled that tower. No oh, man. All right, quickly. Damn it. <laughs> And when you got two monsters that can disable, you see the issue. Come on, quickly. Damn it! <laughs> Alright. Well. There ends up being... What the hell? He's just swimming across. Ah, there we go. Managed to upgrade beforehand. Uh, I'm just waiting for him to get on land so I can drop fire on his dumb face. I'm also waiting... I don't... I really don't want to waste my, my attack when he's in his shell. There we go. All right, he went in a shell and absorbed some of it, but not all of it. Uh, can we upgrade this? Yes, you are a necromancer. Oh god, this is not great down there. They're just moving slowly inside of their shell. Uh, sink five enemy gunboats achievement. Cool. Yeah, this isn't looking good at all. Uh, the the disabling's very bad. Uh, and a whole bunch of guys are coming over there. I think I jumped the gun on my, um... Can I... Damn it. I was, if, I, if I can use a, a silence thing... Oh my god, why... What is happening? Did you see... I repeatedly was clicking to, to summon troops and it just wasn't working. Um, fortunately, it looks like... Uh, these guys only do one point of damage when they get through. I assumed it was going to be more. Uh, alright, good. I think I can stop them anyway. Good. Uh... Get these guys. Okay. Final wave? Final wave. Let's do this. Uh... Uh, I certainly wish the magic from this tower could fit up there, but... You know, I'm just gonna let those guys chill over there. I have to concentrate on defending over here, I think. We are. Yeah. Let's... can't even do it. Let's see that little parakeet. You gonna throw a bomb, little parakeet? Probably not, because the towers keep on getting disabled. <laughs> oh, well. All right, right here. Good. Now, uh, I would really love them to be silenced, and then I couldn't disable my towers. Disable them before my towers get disabled. That's what I want. Those guys aren't amazing, those soldiers, but I figure if there's a bunch of them. Okay. How much more do we have to deal with? How, how much health did he have again? No, that's a green fin. There we go. 900. That's a lot, especially with the high armor, but when they're hit by magic, that should not be that bad. So I definitely picked the right hero for this one. Because the, uh, there's no one else who could pierce that. Everyone else has a physical attack. Alright, is that it? Are we done? That wasn't bad, and there's no way that's the final one, because people were saying that it was too crazy. There's definitely another stage, and there's definitely a boss, and there's definitely going to be a jerk to me. Oh, no, there might be three. If there's three, I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, 
What I do know, though, is that finally, maximum upgrades. I've never played a Kingdom Rush game where I had maximum upgrades, so that's really cool. I could be a, a jerk. I mean, I'm on mobile. They gave me the option. I could just... Well, I might do that. Fine with using extra lives, just for the better score. In fact, if I had remembered I had that, I would have used it here to get another star. But maybe not, because it's pointless, right? It's just bragging rights. I have enough stars. Stars do nothing. Storm Atoll. Beware the deep devils. After the battle of Port... Port... On the verge of being sunk by treacherous tides and the constant attacks by these nasty creatures, we have come ashore to the dangerous Storm Atoll. We Here we prepare for battle, near the ruins of the Shrine of Roignos, Lord of the Sea. Oh, wait. This is this is a positive. All right, yeah, this, this is totally three stages. I'm going to get help from someone. You will protect... Uh, I should just ask someone to... <laughs> I need to hear that name out loud or I won't ever say it. Right. Ooh! Oh, my God. Full sail ahead! I have a boat hero. Amazing. That's great. Okay, cool. I'm digging it. We got hounds. We got green fins. All right, so... Oh, what is this? Oh, I really want to do this. This might be a mistake, though. Um, repair the shrine to get... Oh, God, I have to. Holy crap. Okay. I think that might have been a good thing. So I've repaired the shrine to, you know, this world's version of Poseidon. I mean, guys are going to come from all over, I'm sure. Level you up. Level you up. Let's do magic here. Um, blockers here. E this here. Dodge this. This here. I, I might be using too many arrow towers now that I'm looking at it. But, I don't know. That's just what I've decided to do right here, and we'll go right here. You know, if it's a bad setup, we'll do it again. That's how it works, right? Release the hounds. And I'll level that up as soon as I can. All right. <laughs> Voodooed them. All right, they're just going right to the exit, aren't they? Well, aren't you guys tricky? All right, moving up. Hey, boat hero. <laughs> cool. All right, yeah, I definitely need to rely on him, like, moving him in the proper place. But I had no idea they were going to go up there. I should have because there's a path right here, but I'd nearing it. All right, I should test this out. Phew! Cool. How long does that take to recharge? Probably a while. Um, let's do bombs. And magic. Cool. All right, next wave. This has already been quite the stage. Uh, hmm. Where are they going? They're not going here, are they? They're totally going there. No, they're just going right there. Oh, God, yeah. The, the path that these guys are taking has been continually unexpected tonight. So I need to be careful. Uh, blocked? Uh, I'm gonna do... Oh, I missed him. I hate it when I, I waste an entire magic... Oh, no, I got him. You notice that there's, like, steam in the water. That's really cool. That's showing that my uh, magical powers actually are working. Move my hero down here. Alright. Is that enough to block? Oh my god, I just missed an entire wave of guys because I wasn't looking. Okay. Uh, I don't know what to do about that. <laughs> I didn't set up a blocker there. I mean, yeah. Oh. Alright, I think in reality these guys maybe need to be here. I don't know if that's enough to block there. And then we'll set up a Necromancer Tower. Maybe that'll give me more warning. But yeah, six guys went past. I'm actually going to use this. Screw it. All right. Um, Devel Devil Tide. Okay. Maybe put an extra, maybe just put capital to the T, then I won't be confused. Light armored shark riders that serve as shock troops for the Deep Devils. Low armor can throw nets. Average speed. And there they are. 400 health. Not a bunch, but you never know. There. 
Ah, uh, yeah, they're going right here, huh? We don't actually have a lot of uh, good defense for that. Except for maybe a pirate that throws bombs at people. Oh, and uh, a god. Phew! <laughs> Dead. Gotta figure out whether that beam that the god does is an area of attack. If it is, I shouldn't be using it on one guy, but... Really not sure. Hard to tell even while looking. Uh, you guys... Oh my god. I, I keep on not paying attention to this side. Oh my god. Click. Do the thing. <laughs> I don't know why these misclicks are happening. Uh, so that needs to be a... Um, that needs to be a uh, Necromancer Tower as soon as possible. Because, uh, yeah, I don't know if these guys actually blocked them. And if that's the case, this is like the worst place they could be. But I need to... I need to. Oh, what the hell are these? Is it... Weird. There's just something in the water and I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Oh, yeah, so he's... I see what's happening now. Yeah, they can't block people that come up here. Ugh. Ook. So if a bunch of guys come, they're just going past. So yeah, my, my blocking guys are helping a little bit because they block the guys that come here, but they're not blocking everyone. So I'm just going to need to remain vigilant, essentially. Something that I sometimes have difficulty doing. However, Necromancer Tower. Hopefully we'll get some skeletons up in here. Okay. And he's... How much damage does he do? Yeah, well, 80 to, to 100 damage per hit. So, yeah, this guy's awesome. Uh, I would really love to get the other uh, Poseidon benefits, too, eventually. Uh, yeah, no, I shouldn't move. I really hate the zooming in. Like, stop. Before I updated the emulator, I never did that. Uh, let's kill these guys, even though it's probably not the area that I need help at, but whatever. What ever. Actually, if I got this leveled up, like, high enough, that would be the biggest help, wouldn't it? Ooh, he just got stunned in the water. Ha. <laughs> because if, if we got level up here, then guys wouldn't be able to sneak back here as easily. Hmm. Well, we'll see what happens. Bunch of red fins coming in. Yeah, they're gonna go into my, my, uh... Defender blind spot. One of those little guys just got through there. Yep, and he's getting through on the bottom. Uh, not too bad, though. No one else got through, and we got a bunch of skeletons there now, so that's cool. There's a. Those hero icons are just blocking everything. Ooh. Oh my god, what the hell? Well, I just had uh, Poseidon take out uh, that guy, pretty much. Uh, we're gonna do it. Eh, further blessings. E pew. <laughs> Alright. Things could certainly be going worse. For sure. It ain't too bad. It's just I need to watch out for there. But now we're, we're a little bit protected. And I can make my uh, Skull Guy to, like, block one. Holy crap. Blood Shell. Formidable warriors, their steel-like spikes. Carpus rivers them invulnerable. Oh, immune to artillery damage. That's fine. <laughs> um, wait, they're not just immune to artillery damage. They're immune to. I don't know. I don't know why that's happening. Yeah, they just have great armor. Um, once again, correct hero for this part then, because she has magic damage. She's the only thing that is hurting him right now. All right, so we better level this up. Yeah, thanks for zooming in. This is great. It's just what I wanted. Love it when things zoom in without me telling him. I'm going to have to concentrate a lot on killing this guy. He has, yeah, he can't get past. He has five uh, five skulls. If he gets through, we lose five health. That'd be devastating. Uh, don't get distracted by doges. All right, that should do some damage. Yeah, he's, he's, he's the big boy of this stage. And these troops aren't here to damage him, they're just here to hold him. Whew, got him. Me like. Wise from the grave. Cool. And we're almost got an earthquake tower. That'll help with the top thingies. And actually, hmm. 
Yeah, someone told me there's a weird targeting thing. That my 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 gun here was definitely targeting people it shouldn't reach, which I'm fine with, <laughs> but weird. And there's one of those big strong skull or shield guys, but they can't use their shield when they're in the water. Because he has a little rowboat, you see. It's kind of funny that the, the turtle guy needs a robot. <laughs> Guess he can't swim as well as some of the other guys. With my hero here, I think we're okay. I mean, a little, I am a little bit concerned about this guy, actually. <laughs> but, and my hero can't actually move up there to do anything. Uh, maybe I do this and increase the range. They can attack him up there. Oh, also, he can do something. Oh, move back, move back, move back. He was about to die. Good. <laughs> move my pirate down here. She has full health again. Move her in. How, how far can he move down? There. Now he's in range. Yeah, that turtle has, like, full health. Like, get out of here. Like, nothing's hurt him. Ugh. Uh, we want this. That guy can definitely block people to cut. Well, now I can't move him because that guy's being a jerk. Get up here. Get up here, you stupid turtle. Get out of your shell. Oh my god, he's not getting out of his shell. He's cheating. He's just being a big, big old cheat face. Alright. Here. Good. Now my towers won't be disabled while millions of guys come at once. That would be nice. Uh, let's move my captain up here. Try to help with that. Someone is getting through. Or they're not. Ha. <laughs> um, we got a lot of stuff here, so increase range, increase range. Oh, don't increase range, then. Yeah. Increase range. All right. This is this episode is going to be too long if there's another stage. Oh, well. It's fine. I'll... I'll I've probably edited more brutally than normal. Ugh, oh, not you again. Alright, move down. Move down. Yeah. There. Oh, he, he packs way too much of a punch. Right, move back. We should be moving back until this mage tower anyway. And then I'll turn... Oh, wait a minute. Pew. There we go. Nice chunk of health. Excellent. I gotta remember I have that thing. It's easy to forget. And he's gonna be a disabled jerk. I just figured I'd go through a little bit. I'm giving my places, myself places to cut out. I've been rambling the whole time because my brain is stimulated with new things. Sometimes I'm just like, this wave is done. Don't need to say anything. But that hasn't happened yet because I'm just... There's... This, this is a... This might be the most complex map that I've ever seen in any of the games that I've played from the series. There's just so many different arcs I need to pay attention to. Now, I wish he would stop. He's not going to stop. I'm going to bomb him in the water, then. There. <laughs> cool. And maximum Poseidon. I'm going to wait till I see, like, a crab person. Actually, let's see if this is an area attack. No, it looks like it just kills one guy, or they just weren't close enough together. Bluegill, commander of the Deep Devils. They unleash storms to aid their brethren. Immune to magic can summon storms. Ranged attacks. Okay. Uh, let's level this up then. And... Oh, I don't know what that storm does, but I don't like it. Also, my hero is useless against them if they're immune to magic. In fact, yeah, this, this place was uh, so set up to do magic. Oh, God. Um, are they also immune to my fire? I need to test this now. They are not. My fire, once again, is like a non-elemental crazy thing. Uh, can I get my hero to possibly hit them? I can't even see them. Which is not great. Eh, this. Oh, these storms suck, just because I can't tell what's happening. <laughs> uh, is he t he's taking damage from something. Probably my, my, yeah, my troops, but I can't see. Oh, also my hero is hitting him, okay. 
Yeah, those storms are more annoying than I thought. They're more annoying than anything I thought was going to happen. Alright, what do you got for me? Red Spine, dead. Oh god, really? Alright. Uh, this guy should really be up here, though, for the sneaky guys. Uh, I'd love to upgrade my gun, but I do like that this is reaching the island over there. That's great. So far, though, it's just like red fins. We can take them. Yep, not a big deal. Not a big... Oh, hello, crab. Arrgh. You're in the way. Boom. Now, how much damage did that do? That did over a thousand points of damage. So that's great. Uh, and I don't know how fast it charges up, but if I hit him again, he'll die. So I'm just going to ignore him. That's probably what I'm going to do. I just need to... There's probably some type of visual indication of when I can use this again. I just haven't figured that out. And there also might not be a visual <laughs> indication. Actually, he looks like he's taken enough damage just from everything. Yep, he's dead. Didn't need to beside in his face. And that would stop. All right, so that's how much time I have. Um, tomahawk. Disabling things. Just hoping that if a, a, a turtle comes, I can disable the disabling. Pew, pew, pew. All right. Second to last wave. Uh, no, I was going to move my captain down, but, like, we're having issues down here. Um. Hmm. Let's release the fire. That's the whole point. Of the earthquake towers are great. But, like, I, well, they're good. But you release the fire, then they're great. And I, I didn't even fire upgrade that one. That's, <laughs> like, the whole point. And that doesn't count as magic, presumably, so that would actually hurt those storm guys also. Uh. I don't like what's happening. Uh, level up that undead guy. Let's get some poison cloud, maybe. Just put put my uh, conscripts in that cloud. And level up the gun. Let's shoot these bluegills. Yeah! <laughs> Just unloaded a full gun into one. Oh! These are... I, I didn't know what those were. Um, those are landmines that my hero is setting. Cool. So I should be putting him on the path of people, then. So that he sets them in a place that actually damages people. That's awesome. Got my mech. Of course, they're immune to... That, that guy's immune to artillery. But, whatever. Move my hero down. He's taking minuscule amounts of damage, but now that my hero's there, plop, and there's another, another giant crab. Dead. Thank you for watching over us, great guy that I must take for Poseidon. Boom, he's hitting my mind. Boom, he hit my mind. Boom, he hit my mind. <laughs> yeah, I ain't disabling anything in the water, buddy. Dropping mines. Let's go for a direct block from my Capione. Oh, damn it. I, I, don't, I don't think he silenced him in time to stop the storm. Or he can't stop the storm. I don't know which one it is. Uh, make a whirlwind for the first time. I don't know if that was the best use of my money, but whatever. I see you, Krabby. Pew. I don't want no crabs. Right on the bluegill. Because my fire magic ain't magic. It's just a fact of reality. I just warp reality to keep... Oh, the whirlwind um, did not appear where I thought it would. But okay. I think we did it. And I have... And 18. And 18. That means I get three stars. Admittedly, I cheated to do it. But it's fine. Boom. Okay. We're at 43 minutes. I would normally call it. I really wanted this to be the last episode, though. I do want to move on from this game. Eep. All right. It's just going to take some creative editing is all. Um, 
The Sunken Cathedral. This has to be the last one in the game. God. Okay, the Deep Devils have awakened Leviathan, the evil deity of the depths they worship. If Leviathan attains its full power, there is nothing in the world that can stop it. No time to regroup or recover. We must head into Leviathan's lair. The city of Rygath was once the seat of Rhinos' power. <laughs> Rhinos. <laughs> it is time to defeat the Deep Devils and their malevolent god once and for all. Okay, this also looks very complicated. My brain is trying to comprehend what's going to happen, and it doesn't like it. We got green fins and green fans. What a surprise. I'll just go for it. All right, let's see what happens. I had so many, like that last stage wasn't too rough. I only got distracted once. Um, I mean, it's mainly just that, uh, Oh no. Really? Is that is that not a bridge? And a guy is snuck past already while I was napping trying to figure something out. Eh. Okay. Well that's not good. Uh yeah. There should I should have had someone block there. But I didn't know. So Hmm. I mean I could change it. I don't know. Let's just try to defend it more power. I'll, I'll, I'll make this one once again my my go-to when I don't have a place properly defended. I'll turn this magic thing into a uh, into a necromancer. They're getting so many of them are getting so through already. It's crazy. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't like any of this. I I hate the zooming so much, guys. But there's nothing I can do about it. Unless there, there must be some type of default uh, control thing that changed when I updated, but I don't know how to switch it. I'll just keep zooming back out. All right. Like, I thought this was a bridge. This is not a bridge. In fact, can she even walk over here? Oh my god, she can't. My hero was permanently trapped over here. Holy crap. That is a disadvantage that they've never levied on me before. Okay. <laughs> Not great. Uh, I think there's actually a few heroes that can fly. If you have that hero, like the dragons, I think they can fly. I don't know for sure, though. But then they would be the best one for the stage, because then the hero could go everywhere. But crap. That means I, I need to concentrate on defending this side more than the other one. Because my hero can't just come by and save me. Eep. Eep, eep, eep. All right. Well, now I know. I've only taken three damage. Who knows what the uh, what the boss is gonna do though? All right. That way of taken care of. All right. Those guys got through. Damn it. Uh. Got. I, yeah. I just need to concentrate on this side. I mean, uh, more guys have gotten through on this side than that side though. So maybe I don't need to concentrate. It. Whatever. It's all bad. <laughs> it's all rough right now. There, there, and I'm only on wave three. There we are. Okay, they beat them back. It's been a green fin bonanza so far. And they're gonna disable my, that guy's gonna disable my towers over here. Oh, I don't like that. I'm worried about all that. Well. Keep on. Oh wait, where's he going? Is he coming? He's coming down this way. Okay, not what I expected, but that's a good thing. Cause I can defend more easily over here, especially against someone who's weak against magic. Uh, there we go. All right, so we're gonna drop that right on your face. Well, I need my towers right now. You can't just keep disabling them. He's getting through. Nothing I can do about it because the tower was disabled. I think. I think my uh, mage tower would have helped if that wasn't the case, but it was disabled at the time. <laughs> so just one. Oh, so close. Come on. Boom. All right. Now we're getting extra help over there by way of corpses coming back to life. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, they're sneaking in. They sneak in as best as they can. 
I am worried about the boss. People are just like... <laughs> it was mainly the boss that people were saying were like, mm, <laughs> yeah, Best be careful with that boss. Alright, Turtle Man. You got a good thing going right now. Alright, releasing next wave. Blood Shell? Uh-oh. I, uh, I don't have the god to help me. Oh god, tentacles have just disabled my <laughs> tower there. Because of course they have. Okay. There's the blood shell. Yep, he's gonna be here. <laughs> At least I do have some magical recourses in this path down here. And they've thrown nets on my poor guys so that they can't even move. Ugh. Where, oh god, he's coming right in here, huh? Ugh. He's taken, <laughs> like, under 100 points on damage of damage on the way over. But he's about to take a lot more. And right on your face. Do, 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 do. Steamed crab, anyone? Oh, my hero's dead. Alright. Let's make you. How much? Click, click, click. <laughs> uh, oh well, this is just going to be an issue going forward. Let's see. Devil Tide and Redfin. What can I do? What should I do? Where am I? Who am I? What am I? I could get, I could get assassins to try to steal money. At the very least, let's make them a little bit more powerful. Uh, do I want to use my fire spell here or save it? I think we save it for right now. Yeah. Yeah, save it for that jerk right there. Is that enough to kill him? No, but he's very hurt. I might have to level this up just for him. As he's immune to magic, if you remember. Yeah, there we are. Yeah, even my regular troops are doing something to him. But my magic towers aren't. <laughs> and it's like all magic towers. So the tomahawk should finish him off. Um, I think this wave is pretty much done, so we're going to release this. But there's more black surges coming. Maybe I could level that up for the black surges. Just do a little bit of damage to them. I don't know. Uh, and there's the blood crab. Yeah. No, he has no defense against magic, so... Not as concerned. He can... He's immune to the, uh, the attacks. Like, the, uh... The bomb attacks. And yet, he, uh, still gets stunned by them. Also for my arrow tower, who's taking one point of damage per hit, which is... Atrocious, obviously. <laughs> Down here, things aren't too bad, though. Uh, maybe they are. Uh, it wasn't able to save my hero on time. Um, this combination is really bad. It's the, uh, my towers are being disabled, and the only thing that can kill that crab is magic. Oh, God, and there's no magic to hit him. Oh, now she's back, though. Oh, she needs to not die. Holy crap, she needs to not die. Kill the crab. There, crab is dead. <laughs> That was a terrible combo. Um, Templars, make them bleed. Amazingly enough, we weathered the combo. I didn't think that we would. My Templars are not attacking currently, so move in there. Okay, let's release the next wave. Think this is this is this is hectic for sure. What is that? Huh. Wonder if I drop fire on them, if that'll make the, uh... Wonder if I can make that guy go away by dropping fire on him. I'm not... I don't really want to test it, though, because if the answer is no, I'll lose my fire spell, and I'm probably going to need it soon. Yeah, alright. That was, uh... That was just a practice wave, because the real one's coming, me thanks. Hmm. Was gonna do an earthquake tower there. 
Yeah, I still think I should do an Earthquake Tower here. Yeah. Or I should just ignore it. I think there's probably places that are... Yeah, do an Earthquake Tower here would be better. Uh, so you can... Yeah. Oh, they're gonna get through. One of them got through. Not too bad. There, all right. Uh, and it looks like I can't use my towers when the, the storms are there. All right, you, sir, need to stop. I think I missed him for the most part, but... Oh, and she's not going to do anything. He's immune to magic. Well, whatever. There, I upgraded to fire. That should help when it goes off finally. <laughs> if it goes off finally. Oh, dear. Oh, dearie me. We're on wave 10. I'd rather she didn't die. Move back to people who can actually damage, please. And the fire is setting in. Ah. Must quicken the fire. All right. Uh, I, I am confident they're going to deal with that situation over there, so let's move on. Barely know what that situation is. I think it's just a few red gills. Oh. Don't like this. Don't like this. Ooh, but they're burning in the water. Do you like that? I'm gonna drop this right on your head. There's a lot. There's a lot of guys there. Oh, no. All right. More fire damage. More conscripts. Actually, yeah, they're... <laughs> The fire damage is tearing those uh, these guys up, the bluegills. So that's good. But uh, I'm pretty much relying on it. The magic tower can't help, except to raise zombies, which does help. So, but yeah, there's a full bluegill assault down there, and three blood shells. There's there's gonna be five blood shells that are about to spawn. Let's do it. <laughs> Might as well. All right, I need to test this. Yep, that was a waste. That didn't actually get rid of that guy that's making the claw. I, I didn't. I wasn't sure if it would, and it didn't. Um, can you guys move here to maybe block one of those guys? Yes, is the answer. Beautiful. Turn you into assassins. Okay, that actually worked out okay. I'm down to nine health, however, which isn't the best. Th those early uh, losses definitely hurt me. I'm just going to use this. I don't have a lot of confidence that I'm going to beat it this round, so let's see as much as possible. Plus, I need to leave, like, in half an hour, so I'm actually kind of cutting it close. <laughs> um, block, please. Get her health back. I don't... I, I'm not going to be able to stop that guy, and he's going to do five damage. So, and I might not be able to stop that guy, and he's going to kill me then. Actually, no, he won't kill me, but it's still bad. <laughs> it's still, all of it's still bad. Uh, all right, he should be dead at least. All right, let's get the drill. I feel like this building is so critical that I'm willing to do that. And all right, unfortunately, the crab guy wasn't in, in uh, place of my Templars. He probably, I think, bleed damage can't be blocked by armor. I don't know though. I could just be saying that. All right, that that entire wave was a little no nothing wave. I do think, I mean, unless something crazy happens on the next wave, I do think I'll at least get to see the boss, even if I can't defeat him. But what if I do? What if I do? <laughs> Wouldn't that be great? The answer is yes, it would. And I should have leveled this up a long time ago. I feel like that's gonna do some early damaging that'll that would have been quite helpful, especially against those bluegills. Ooh, you. We ain't want none of you. Excellent. <laughs> Down to 300. Is he healing himself? I didn't know he could heal himself. What the hell, man? You get out. I almost killed him, and now he's just like, I'm back. <laughs> Not cool. Alright, I don't even know if he's going to get to shore, though, at this point, which is nice. Uh... Certainly use some magic damage to deal with him, but... Nah, we'll get that in a second. Chunk. Oh! 
we can just kill that bluegill, and we can stop the crab there. Then good. The magic tower should do a lot to taking care of that while my assassins block for them. Move the Voodoo Queen back a little bit. Increase the amount of, uh... Increase the likelihood of my, uh, drill just gibbleting this guy. That would be good. Crap, my hero died. Oh, God. Bad situation. I might lose here. One, two, three. E. I'm going to barely survive with one health. So the only reason I didn't lose is because I used hearts. So it actually did matter this time, but... That would have been really sad to go through all this and not see the boss. What if there is no boss? Then I win. I Yeah, okay. <laughs> all right. That looks like Cthulhu. If I ever saw Cthulhu, which I did. He's right there. I see him. It's Cthulhu. Let's level up. Start hitting him. Um, that's a lot of health. That is Leviathan. Are you really not going to attack? There we go. I mean, you're attacking someone. Not attacking who I want. Let anyone gets through now, I lose also. So remember that. <laughs> That's another complication. All right. Uh, <laughs> um, there, now he's attacking him. Good. Good, good. Oh, boy. And he's disabling towers. He is taking continual damage, so that's nice. Um, I'd like to get some missiles, but we need to make another kill, so... Someone can murder someone. That red gill might do it. Good. Missiles, please. Uh, Alright, he's, he's in range of this, and he's taking continual damage. We just need to keep everybody off, and we're fine. Dropping this on you, boy. All right, we might have this. We might freaking have this. That would be so nice if I didn't have to play the stage over again. Um, what do I do? Set up another tower really quick. Let's do it. Hope that no one sneaks by because a lot of guys are down there and it just takes one, as I mentioned. All right. We're doing it. We're doing it. Even sending these guys to attack. Come on. 2,000 health, love. Can my hero reach from there? She can. She's adding her personal voodoo magic. Oh. Oh, God. She's not attacking him anymore. She's getting distracted. She needs to not die. Damn it. All right. Okay. 800 health. Fire! Oh my god, I actually did it. Um, <laughs> I feel a little bit bad that I used those items. I didn't think that it would come down to that, but it absolutely did. Um, still, that was a good stage. I, I really So, this cost me an extra $2 to get those just those extra stages. Worth it. Good stages. Like, really, especially these ones were actually really fun. They, they really, you know, when you're dealing with a water... You're trying to defend a water place against people who can swim and you can't swim. Good mechanic. I love the hero. I love the Poseidon beam. It was like that that temple in the first game. Uh, the hot, yeah, no, excellent extra content. I appreciate it. And thank you very much for watching. This is the final episode of Kingdom Rush Frontier. Uh, the next uh, game in the series is Kingdom Rush Origins. I will be playing it. I've never played it before, and I don't know when I'll be playing it. I want to move to something else now. I don't know what the future holds. All I know is that it's uncertain and filled with fish people. I am Cross Knights. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you, as always, to my patrons. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.